Yeah. Hey, welcome back to the score. We're gonna get right back to the action. Morrison looking to stay perfect, taking on Erie Prophets Sound. That's Chase Newman with a first down. Later on, it's Carson Stratting getting the handoff and rumbling his way, plowing people over 20 yards in the first down. That would lead to this. The quarterback draw from Colton Bielema, 15 oh, yard touchdown. Morrison would take a lead in the second half. They never give it back. And they're undefeated 32 13, your final in that one. A great rivalry between mm. Sherrard and Rock Ridge. Third quarter, Holland Anderson is going to drop back, scramble, looking downfield, and he's going to find mm. Carter oh. Brown. Oh, what a catch. Touchdown 23 yards, 21 17. Rainmaker at it front. again. <laughs> Rock Ridge, fourth and short. No offender breaks through the back, into the backfield. Big stop for the Tigers as they hold, still at the lead. Fourth quarter. Rockets defense comes up with a big play as the ball is in the air and it is Connor Deem sky and high for the INT. On the very next play, Rockets punch it in. Colin Schweigen calling his own number. Wow, He's got his blockers in front of him. 44 yards to the house, 24-21 Rock Ridge in front. But the Tigers do have an answer. Again, Anderson buying some time, finds his favorite target, Brown. Touchdown, 28-24 oh. Tigers, but Rock Ridge would get a late score. They win 31-28. Kiwani looking for a perfect 4-0 start to the season as well, visiting Euro Valley. First quarter of the storm, Corbin Chiam, great return to midfield from the kickoff. He just goes, then finally out of bounds. Boilermakers would get some things going. Cruz Paderas. How about a little defense? Gets the interception off a tip pass, so Kiwani would get the ball. We go to the second quarter. Boilermakers would capitalize. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, cute baby. Yep. Braden Clark, the long pass to number eight, Benjamin Taylor. It's first and goal. <laughs> and Kiwani would capitalize on that. They would get the TD. They go up 14 0, and they roll in this one. They stay perfect 42 20 in the final. Hey, let's head to Orion. 2 and 1 Chargers oh, welcoming boy. 2 and 1 Princeton in a Battle of two and one teams. Princeton looking good. Casey Etheridge, see how I did that? That's I good math. Pulled it all together. <laughs> no wonder you made it in hey, journalism. That's the Ambrose advantage, Mr. Pearson. Later in the quarter, it's Ace Christensen for the touchdown. Tigers went up 21 0 at that point. This one, all Princeton. We'll show you a final after that first down right there. Tigers looking good. 42 0, your final in that one. Hey, let's go to the LLC. Mercer County looking for a third straight win. Hosting Farrington, first quarter. Farrington facing fourth and short. Murko comes up with a big stop. Several guys there to get the ball back for their offense. The Golden Eagles would do it through the air as Kobe Cox connects to William Fredrickson for a first down. They eventually score. Not a whole lot going on in this one. 34 unanswered at one point for uh, Farmington. They win 42-13. A battle of two and one teams again in Anawan. It's Anawan Weathersfield and Monmouth United. Good math, Dazzo. Third quarter, Zip Rashid. How about a TD? Anawan would go up 14 nothing. Great kid. Love that kid. Then Dylan Horry would make his presence known with the QB keeper. It's another TD. They go up 21 to nothing. Anawan rolling 35 to zero. Your final score. Top five showdown in eight man Ridgewood. Number three welcoming number five Polo. Third and 14 Polo. The pass is intercepted by Sean Wyatt, returned for a touchdown. Get out of the way, we're looking at a highlight. <laughs> Polo with the ball here, they hand it off and they find nothing but daylight ahead. This is Brock Stelto going 60 yards to the end zone. This one would go back and forth all evening. Polo wins a really good football game. 48-44, your final in that one. All right, right, eight man, number two, Millersville, welcoming Orangeville. Millsville marching down the field. Connor Nye keeps it. It's a race to the pylon, and he's going to win it. It's 8 0 missiles. The defense stopped stepping up for the missiles. Spencer Nye grabbing the interception. He's got great hands, and we are going to go the other What do you think of the group. shooting in this game? Outstanding. It is <laughs> clearly a Wiley veteran. Greg Armstrong. <laughs> Next play, it's Nye with the home run ball to Connor Johnson for the 28 yard TD pass. It's 14 0. Later in the first, missiles. They're going to go to the ground. Micah Thomas-Smith shaking a tackle Woo. and running over everyone. We will see you later. Milledgeville is your winner, 50 Jeez. to 24. And about people stepping in front of people, you are renowned for that, Did actually, I, I think, Aaron. At least photo bombing. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we're going we're gonna to quickly go to break. We've reached halftime. Much more on the score. I'm getting out fast.